Hey guys, so it is day one of spring break. So I'm super excited. Um, today, as you can see, I'm like in the bed. I'm about to take a nap before this like seven-ish, eight-ish hour drive. Um, I got all my stuff packed up. So basically, we're going to get some community service in. I can't tell y'all where we're going next. Y'all def y'all probably figure it out in like 10 seconds. But we're going to get some community service in. Going to get some word in. It's a Bible study trip, by the way. It's going to be super fun. And yeah, it where we're going, it's honestly impossible to not have fun. Like, you really would have to try to not have fun. Um, so can't wait. All right, so hey guys. what we got in here? On the way to I'm excited. We are picking up my cousin from Fort Wayne. Well, Winona Lake, Indiana is where I go to school, so Indiana. So we're gonna get back <laughs> in the car. There's an other car following us. I'm driving, so I can't really vlog. But there we go. So we got Andrew. Alexandria. I'm Phoebe. And yeah, so they're in the car with me. So I guess I'll see y'all back when we actually get somewhere. Or probably on a pit stop on the way there. Are you vlogging? So after an eight hour drive, we finally made it to New Orleans. <laughs> People yelling at me. But anyway, catch y'all tomorrow. We have some fun things in store, so I'm like really excited. All right, y'all, so morning of day two. I did why you look at the camera like that. <laughs> morning I didn't know of day two, and um, oh, we're you a little stressed. Vlog? We're a little stressed, hey. yes, I am. <laughs> we're a little stressed this morning. Um, we're trying to get out to the swamp tour before like, with like 12 people that don't know where they're trying to go. So So somehow we ended up in the mall like true tourists do, you know? So Alexandria wants to get some shoes. So a little she we'll see what we get, you know. And then we gotta go get some food. So I got this crawfish po boy with some hash puppies. Ooh. Yeah. Crawfish po boy. 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 And then some hush puppies. Okay, okay. But yeah, it's really good. And where is it from? No, do have something. I don't even know. They got pepper. It's from Mike Anderson. Mike Anderson's. So pretty. Look at it. What college are we at? Um, Fort Wayne. 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 Fort I'm about to go walk around, see what the nightlife is like on this campus out here. And uh, probably pretty different from Athens, Georgia. So we're walking down and these lovely people over here are making grilled cheese on the foot alone. So it's great. So yeah. Great things. What is this? Tulane? Yeah. Great things in Tulane. Alright, cool. And I was like, I really should have like recorded this this entire time, but we're over here like in a window seal. I can do our know. makeup. It looks great. Thanks, Chuza. <laughs> Asian I'm over here wearing. with the glitter. Forever with the glitter. Forever with the glitter. Like it's an everyday look for her. Yeah. It's not no like, oh, special occasion. Nope. No. <laughs> Every day. I'm, I'm gonna ask her if I can use this glow palette. No. And be expensive. Well, wow. she said no. Alright, never mind. Okay.
glossy look. There we go. That's better. Glossy red. And then I gotta do something with my hair. <laughs> I'll probably just throw a hat on like normal and call it a day. So after our devotional thing, we decided we were gonna leave, but somebody lost their keys. Oh my gosh. Adrian wants y'all to see her new pumas that she got. Okay. She's okay. Oh. So when you did that, you they're real nice. Too. They're real nice. I like them to be honest, but <laughs> so yeah, we're kind of waiting. Like everybody's car is like locked in, so we'll see. insert the pictures that we just took but we just took so many pictures in this little like mirror sculpture it's actually ridiculous so while we're taking pictures andia her phone was already cracked but you know you try and like not crack it yeah oh you can't see it turn the um turn the screen off so it's black like look at this this struggles can you see it yeah Hey man, get a protective case on y'all's phone then. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. So we finally made it to downtown New Orleans. We in the NO, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, look. All right, everybody want to have to fool in the We all chill. But yeah, we're about to go into this, this little really place. This look like them little shops on uh, this, little, this little candy store. Real quick. So what were you saying? Since you're getting footage, I must tell you on camera, this, well, it's halfway gone now, but this is A1. <laughs> Good to know. Where is it from? Oh, it's a Louisiana turtle. It's a white chocolate. It is from this Loris Candies. Alright. Thank you, ma'am. After a long day, we probably made it here. Let them see this. One, one, two. Where is this? Where is this? Where that, though? Y'all, so I showed y'all where we came to eat, right? Don't ever come here. Please look at this. Don't come here. So about to look at Adrian's face. Don't come here. 
Cafe Mesfiro. Cafe Mesfiro. It's trash. Don't come here at all. The food was not good. It was not seasoned. Um, the portions were small. It was just all trash. It still cost like 13, 15 type of dollars. My bill was 20. Like 20, yeah, 20. So it's just not, no, no. That's our, that's our hot take on it. Y'all like, that just elbowed me dead in my We're so hot too. We're so hot. Monday, about 10 o'clock a.m. Um, we've already driven to the place for our community service today. We're at a church in Baton Rouge. Um, basically, the guy was explaining to us how, um, what is this, Hurricane Henry? Somebody? Um, but anyway, the hurricane that we went through here most recently was like the third greatest disaster in North no, America. Second. Second, second greatest disaster in, in North America. <laughs> Katrina was third. And Sandy, was one. Sandy yeah. Hurricane okay. Sandy was number one. So basically, he was just explaining, like, this was really crazy. And how, like, some people had, like, 12 feet of water in their house. Like, that's the ceiling, high key. And so, um, just the work that we're doing is going to be really beneficial to these people because, like, one, we're doing it for free. So it will cost thousands of dollars that these people don't have. And then, you know, just doing the Lord's work today. So. Super excited. We'll see if I can like get some good shots of some, you know, get some stuff done, get some good stuff done. this drywall up and um, I think that's about it just putting the drywall up and going from there it will be done <laughs> Okay, so this is Mr. Todd who we're working with today and we'll be back tomorrow. And what are we doing tomorrow? We're gonna hang more drywall and we're gonna put mud on the drywall. Okay, well cool. Um, there's Joy. Alright, everybody just had a reaction. But yeah, so we got basically like most of this wall done. So yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Y'all probably wonder like, it's day three. Why are you in the same place? But yeah, so we're here again. Today we're gonna do drywall and pressure washing, as Todd said previously. Um, we haven't really started yet though, so we'll see what we get done today. So we don't find a little like wing spot, of course, because they tried to feed us sauce and noodles. So, I think why is either way. Sometimes we look for the judgment of our peers, the people who uh, we consider to be higher than we are. But when you recognize that everybody we judge does, that everybody's on the same platform. And so our goal should never be to please one another in the sense that we must make sacrifices that may compromise our faith for other people. 
we have to stay strong to who we believe in who we know to be the highest. Brothers, how to treat a lady. I let you ride when I ride that Mercedes. And I ain't tripping or acting shady. Cause baby, you know I ain't never had nobody show me all the things that you gon' show me. In a special way, I feel when you hold me. We gon' always be together, baby. That's what you told me. And I believe it. Cause I ain't never had nobody do me like you. Hey, yo. What's up? What's up? What's up? Where's the music? What are you singing to? My car. <laughs> oh. <laughs> for like 30 minutes um, and we drove we found this place called New Orleans Creole cookery uh, it looks promising they got paper on the table so I have hope I have hope <laughs> Alright, so this is what Adrian got. Y'all, it's real lit here. Like, you got the candles. <laughs> so we got the jambalaya, the red beans oh. and rice, the oh. creek, oh. what is it, crawfish, a two fig, and the shrimp creole. So all the food under two. What? Dinner. We're about to eat. Let's wait. Eat. <laughs> hey, y'all. So it is the last day, full day, in New Orleans. Adrian and I are out here trying to find some local art. Um, you know, just trying to get get a little bit of culture. The culture. You feel, you feel me? Get a little culture. Hey, uh, first thing I got. We've left and we're like at the restaurant now, but this is the first thing I got. I like it. It's really colorful, and I like the little scene we got. We got the little French, you know, double decker deck. Let's the porch. And then I got this, which is really nice. It's like a little city scene. Um, Decatur Street, the horse carriage is parked. And then I also got this one. Um, it just says Black Oak. Apparently, this is from a scene in a movie. So he wrote the movie on the back. So <laughs> y'all check out this movie and let me know. I'll see. <laughs> so we're on the way back. I we're left video. Oh. Wow. So we're on the way back, <laughs> and uh, almost uh, we're like an hour out from the airport. We dropped my cousin back off, and then we'll be on our way back to Athens. Finally, finally. Thanks for watching, BNG, and always remember.